College of Dentistry has reinvented its entire imaging system along with the clinical aspects of dentistry that we support. We stand now right at the cutting edge, the leading edge of technology and patient care. Now with the digital imaging that we have, both the two-dimensional imaging and the three-dimensional imaging in a digital format, it allows us to get the images with less radiation, it allows us to store the images quickly and easily. It allows us to transfer the images to other specialists within the building so we can get second opinions when necessary. So the patients benefit from less radiation, from ease of operation, from the opinions of all the clinical specialists within the building when needed. And our students benefit as well because a graduate from the College of Dentistry will be trained in what's best for his or her patients. In the digital workflow, the amount of error is basically zero. It's very predictable and very precise. For example, we may make a final impression for a crown. In the old days, we would take the material and put it in your mouth and wait for it to set up. And then we have to pour casts, and it, it, it's a very long, arduous procedure. But now we can actually take a wand and put it in your mouth, take a picture of the crown preparation, and we can actually have that crown made for you within a matter of hours, instead of the patient having to wait two, three, four weeks for a restoration. Probably the most profound change over the last 10 years has been guided implant surgery. We can now virtually plan an implant surgery before the patient even sits in the chair for the surgery. We know exactly where the implant needs to go by the use of software, which allows us to get that implant in place to closer than a millimeter's accuracy of where we want it to be. So we can actually provide surgical services and restorative services at the same appointment time for a lot of patients. The patient can walk out, go home, and heal with teeth that they can eat with, that they can smile with, that they can go out in public with. And this makes a really big difference in the quality of life for those patients. It really changes lives. There's a lot of great digital technology out there. There's also a lot of technology out there that is not proven. And so we can take this technology into our laboratories before it goes to the patient. We can do evidence-based studies on it to make sure that it is effective, that it's reliable, that it's predictable, that it's efficient. And that will in turn affect the way that this digital technology advances oral health. We are uniquely poised to affect the future of digital dentistry.